What's up, YouTube? YouTube, this is my Porsche 944. Um, I just took the headlight assembly out because I'm going to try to uh, primer this whole section in, basically from this end all the way around towards that end, and uh, probably try to get the hood and uh, go from there. sand this part I had to use some a uh, little body filler that like little uh, dents but it you know it didn't I uh, used 180 sand it down then I went to 320 uh, hit it with 600 I ended up like using primer so I'm gonna have to go back with 320 just to make sure Guys, I got a hot mess, so I got to paint this. I probably can't knock all this water and stuff on there, all the humidity. But I have to paint this, those. <clears throat> then I have to paint this right here. I got this uh, fender right here that's painted. And got everything right here. I was supposed to paint the rest of it uh, last night, but I wasn't able to. We're well, trying to uh, primer all this in. I uh, sanded the spots that have um, like rusted a little bit, like this one spot right here. After sitting in the elements and stuff, um, thing I have to do is just sand it down, and then I use like some self inching uh, to get it off. I gotta fill that up right here, that little uh, spot, and get this roof. But I want to paint this whole side right here. Have this whole everything primer. I took the back plate and all that off. Um, so we're gonna make sure we uh, good. Uh, I got a lot of mess to clean up. So I gotta call one auto parts store. I'm gonna go over there, see if they got what I need. If they don't, then I'm gonna have to wait and hopefully they have it. So. So guys, um, this late night footage, I was gonna let the video be uh, three minutes, but I felt like it was too short. Uh, probably like, why the hell you got a nice scratch in the paint? Really not. I'm trying to get all this paint. Uh, whoever painted this, they just painted like right over uh, this uh, color. I mean, I mean the gold right here. I forgot what the previous owner was telling me about. I know we used to have talked about it before, but I've been a while ago. I ain't talked to previous owner in a while, so. But if you look at his videos and all that, um, I don't know, well, it's crazy. Whoever, you know, just paint it black right over top of it. It's just come right off. Now this was a beautiful gold color, beautiful gold color. But I want to go with something different, something more settled. So it's going to be uh, pretty interesting. I got to sand this whole thing down right here. Um, I just got to finish primering this whole section. That'd be good. Only thing I might have to do is this area. I might do it all in black, like recoat it in black, like primer and then uh, paint it in black. Uh, Want to do a different color, but I might just leave it how it is. I might do that one part different color 
and this area just black, but we'll see. Got the engine cover, got most of everything going. Uh, at this state, I might as well just do an engine swap, you know what I'm saying? But hey, it is what it is. Hopefully, I remember uh, to put this car back together because really been a while. I've been taking the pieces apart left and right, so hopefully, everything can be. We done now. I'm probably gonna redo this damn um brake booster setup thing, so I might end up pulling that out or see videos on how to do that, and I might end up doing that. So that's gonna be pretty fun. I got the color right there, and also I'm using this like 2K technology. I already painted one uh, little small panel, and man, it came out like amazing and immaculate. I came out lie. um. I was going to use some other type of brand, you know, and I painted uh, another fender for my Tahoe. I changed the color because I'm planning on changing the color on the Tahoe. So I'm just going as is. Um, I have fixed a few dingers with some of that uh, putty, not putty, I don't know what you, what you would call it, but I fixed the dingers. Had little gashes and stuff right here, but fixed it. <clears throat> but we're gonna see how everything come out. This is like my first time doing this. I was kind of hesitant on doing this. Once I get this whole primer thing, I'm gonna have to take this lid off and primer the edge around here. It won't. The paint won't sit good if I got all this uh, rubberish stuff all around it. Um, so I need to make sure it's sanded it up good. Now, I wonder if I can get this window off by myself. I'm gonna have to just primer that in and. If I do that, I might as well go in and paint the car and, you know, do it how I'm supposed to. But we're going to see. And I got a hot mess, too, so I'm going to clean all this up, this up. But, yeah, she's looking amazing. And I got to uh, paint inside these door jams, too. I can't really get the door off. I was going to take the whole door off, but this post right here, the door hit right here. And other side, the door hit the same thing. I wish I drove the car up or moved it, rolled it over just a, a little bit more before I took the suspension off. So because the suspension and stuff was on still, I probably put the wheels on, drop the car, and then roll it a little bit more. But hey, we at the state, so yeah. With this pieces, I might end up repaying these. Um, what else? And I need to find like a new steering rack probably or redo these boots. I don't know what I'm going to do. But we're going to see. I might end up redoing this panel again. As you can see, I got a little imperfection um, with the little um, filler I had used. So I'm out there just redo this part. And I had discoloration, but I probably could just buff it out. But we'll see. <laughs> 